A great win for us and uh, uh, did it with defense, rebounding, which is what we emphasize, what we told them it could be, and uh, they got the job done. So really, obviously, I, I would have done a team by 18, and that says a lot, and uh, that's what we had to do, and um, got, got it done. So it was across the board. I mean, you look at our guys, everybody got a rebound, more than two, and uh, um, so that was a team rebounding effort. and. Um, I thought our transition was really good early. Um, uh, I thought our execution was really good. Uh, just the turnovers were not only negative, but so many other positives. And so uh, great to see and a great win and uh, excited about the opportunity to go up to Oklahoma and uh, uh, finish this out. So uh, ready to go. What does it say about the team that you guys, Mike only has one point, but you still had to be the top 10 team? Yeah, and we, and we had, you know, we still scored. Uh, well, I, we've got balanced scoring. I mean, I know Mike stands out a lot, but we've played a lot without him, obviously. Um, and, um, you know, I think I, we got to do a better job, I think, with uh, uh, recognizing uh, overplays and denials and traps. Um, but just just wasn't his day, but he kept playing. He played hard on defense and uh, came up with five rebounds. And a lot of times he was playing post defense as well, was guarding on the perimeter. You know, he was matched up on Carl a lot. So, um, you know, the, and their guards. And so, uh, um, you know, we did we did a good job on that. So we, we, kind of, we talked about this being not, a, it wasn't going to be a pretty game just because we knew what uh, what they do and then what we were had to do. And um, uh, we got it done with defense and rebounding. So. Uh, uh, but yeah, we, we've. Uh, it's good to win a game when uh, uh, you know not everybody plays their best game. But I thought we had really good efforts from uh, um, you know with Jacoby and and, and uh, Eddie and, and Xavier. We got uh, you know good production uh, if you add them all up, and that's what we wanted to do. So um, that that was good. It was good to have Rondell out there too, and, and Eddie. They actually practiced really the first two times. So. Uh, that I've seen in practice, uh, so that was progress for us to have them out there just for a little bit of practice and have a little better feel for what we get in the game. So um, it's good to have a ten-man uh, rotation because we needed every guy. And uh, um, you know, great, great win, great atmosphere. Crowd was great, obviously, and uh, you know, it's it's, it's uh, fun to see uh, uh, what uh, uh, we've created here. Coach, you said on Monday that Emmanuel Miller needed to lead the team in rebounding. Um, what did you see from him tonight, and how did his energy and his ability to do the little things affect the game? Yeah, I mean, you know, he's he's uh, he's going to play a lot of minutes, and I don't know that he's uh, leading, but uh, um, you know, we need him to be an elite rebounder, and uh, you know, I think that's something that um, you know you, you got to do what you do best, and we just continue to emphasize uh, getting. Uh, uh, getting him to the offensive glass as well as the defensive glass. So a lot of times on the uh, he's playing on the perimeter, um, gets switched on guards on the defensive end, but the, the, those rebounds on the offensive end are huge for us, and it's something that we haven't been doing as good a job. But we are back to doing it. Um, you know, I think uh, we got our percentage uh, tonight that we want to get to. So he's he's our best offensive rebounder. Um, um, that's going to play minutes. Obviously Xavier Eddie. Uh, Jacoby, you got to give us that too. But um, you know, we want to get back to where we were last year. We just haven't been as good this year for uh, a variety of reasons. You had that little stretch in there where you lost some close games. Mike wasn't there. Um, you had the full lineup. You yeah. think they threw that now? Yeah. I think so I mean, we didn't play. You know, I, it's hard to say you didn't play great, but we got it done. I, I just the one thing was the was the turnovers, which was you know so out of character for us. We're a low turnover team, but. Um, um, I won three out of four, you know, and uh, uh, um, since he's been back, so it's a pretty good sign. I mean, it's just, you know, obviously we have other guys, um, but not having him just put our minutes, you know, just put everybody on it. And then Rondell being out, it really it, it, it compounded it. So obviously we can still win without him having a great game. But, you know, we needed, he's a good defender, so we needed him out there for that too as well. So just, uh, just wasn't. Uh, um, I think they did a good job on him. I've got to do a better job putting him in better uh, position, and uh, we'll work on that today and uh, tomorrow, and uh, uh, and be ready for Saturday. This game, I was. Uh, what do you think about the way that Eddie looked uh, tonight? You know, better, best he's, he's looked, and we saw it in practice. I mean, I it's you know I can't, I can't you know, we've uh, either uh, um, back, shoulder, um, ankle. The, 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 um, the back's bothering him more now. So, uh, you know, we just got, you know, it's just, uh, um, you know, we, we, we uh, it was good to see him practice because uh, he hadn't practiced very little. And so it just hasn't been, uh, you know, we get better in practice and, 
you know, that's, that's the challenge we've had. Uh, but it's good to have Rondell out there too. I think just see what those first time he's practiced, and I can imagine how long. This game almost played out exactly the same way in Austin, big lead, almost yeah. the same halftime lead. Why do you think the result was different this time? Uh, I think we defended better throughout and um, uh, um, and rebounded better throughout. So I think that was that was the, that was the key. So uh, uh, I, I thought that was big. Both teams made their free throws. They had turned into kind of free throw contest. They they kept getting to the line in the second half. That was killing us. Um, both teams making free throws, but it's um, uh, so a lot of good athletes. On a, they're an old team. They're an experienced team. Um, certainly, uh, you would hit the three at the end. Where you know it's just. They never quit, so uh, you know even uh, with it over, they still got the three at the end. Michael Peavy, a couple big deals yeah. there in the first half. What's impressed you the most about him these last couple of weeks? Yeah, you know, again, he's you know he was out for a while, and then he just everybody you know thinks oh they're back there, they're right they're right back into it. It just takes time, and but uh, uh, he's played better, no question, the last couple of games too, and and uh, confident and. You know, we just don't want him to be so reliant on if the shot goes in or doesn't. And, and I think we've seen that with him uh, lately, that he gave us good minutes last game. Uh, it wasn't because of his shot, man, three, whatever. But, um, um, you know, we've, we've got a lot of guys that do different things, and we just got the, uh, 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 we just got to continue to, to use, uh, uh, get as much out of each guy as we can.